another beautiful day always forgetting something just make sure that stays on there nice and tight let's give that a try that feels a little better hey squirrel what you doing so we are off another beautiful day not too chilly uh, definitely not hot but I know that reading weather is coming Whew. I got this new mount to the insta 360 it looks a little floppy so uh, we'll see how that footage turns out I got some good footage with the with the insta a few days ago on that sundial ride it's kind of hard to color match that with my GoPro though so I adjusted the settings a little bit, raised the exposure about a half a stop. It was a little underexposed compared to the GoPro. I have today off and I'm leaving for Klamath bright and early tomorrow. It's going to be a busy few weeks. I mentioned we have that Ninja event in Klamath get back late late Sunday night and then Monday morning I'm heading kind of out of town for another ninja event right after that we have another one so it's just back to back to back and uh, I just wanted to get some get some more footage before that so we are going to head back over to the sundial bridge again I got a free day today, so basically my only time constraint is how much battery life I have. So I'm pedaling on mid mode. It's a bit of a ride, so I just want to conserve as much battery as I can. I know I always say that and then I end up kicking it up into high and then just throttling most of the way, but I don't want to do that this time. Kicked it up a little bit just to uh, help me get up this hill and I'll bump it back down to mid once I get up to the top. Ah, I hate this. I feel like I'm creeping up this hill. like a cigarette they just repainted it recently but it's still the cigarette tower all right here we are at the top of the hill look at that view you can just see the top of the sundial bridge over there see mercy hospital way over there the sacramento river beautiful what's that yeah Thanks, yeah, it's a lot of fun. Thanks. Thanks, yeah, I got I carry everything I need. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's ready to go. Just got the new uh, 360 camera, so getting some, getting some cool shots. Yeah, thanks for chatting, man. Super 73, yeah. Well, have a good one. Yeah, take it easy. Nice guy. All right. Oh, he's beautiful. Those California pop. Tip of the sundial. Man, 
and it really is a beautiful day. It feels great out here. Oh, that's beautiful. Man, I'm a sucker for dogs. I can't help it. Oh, another one. Hi, beautiful. I hope they know I'm talking about their dog. <laughs> you don't think I'm a creep. Just calling people beautiful. This place is pretty cool too, the Arboretum. But, you can't ride in there. This trail is cool too. This goes down, uh, down to Caldwell Park, and then all the way up to the dam actually, all the way up to Shasta Dam. It is the Sacramento River. Beautiful dogs. park for the kids to skate it's nice so Reading definitely has changed in the last few years I think some for the better they're definitely giving a lot of stuff a facelift which is nice seems to be a bit more of a drug problem than there used to be though this is the Caldwell Rec Center I remember coming here for punk shows and hardcore shows Back when straight edge hardcore was a cool thing. We had some park shows here in that parking lot. Under the pavilion here. Back in the punk days. Here is the diesel horse bridge. Incredible view. 
view. See how the river trail goes on both sides of the river here, all the way up to uh, Shasta Dam. Every once in a while, you can see otters. I've seen otters over there. So I'd like to go up to the ribbon bridge, but I'm a little concerned about battery. It is up a ways. not know you were allowed to ride in here. The Turtle Bay Arboretum. They used to have 
like a bird exhibit in here. Lots of ride for another time. Now that I know you can ride bikes in here. I'll have to come back here at some point. So I'll ride across the bridge again. Maybe I can get some food right over there. And maybe I can plug in. Same, same rules as bicycles. No, no, it only goes like 25 miles an hour. Yeah, yeah, no, it'll, I mean, it'll hit like 30 going downhill, but yeah, no, it's basically just a, yeah, 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 it's been a lot of fun. You too. All right. So yeah, it's just constant drain. What kind of range on a charge? Um, on Eco, I can go, I think I've, I'm at about 20 miles today, and I got about, you know, five miles back home, so. Obviously, I could put, it's not fun. <laughs> it is not fun. <laughs> yeah, this thing is heavy. It's a 70, 70 pound, yeah, 70 pound bike, you know, so. I know it's tough. Yeah, I was over. I was just over there looking to see if there was somewhere I could plug in for a little bit. So you want to keep it around 20 miles? Yeah, it's a, just around town. I, you know, I usually just ride to work, charge up when I'm at work, and then ride home, or I'll ride around town a little bit. Right on. But, yeah. Thanks for letting us check that out. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Have a good one. Nice guy. Oh, getting some shade, cute. All right, so yeah, like I was, was saying, I'm just gonna take the same route home, which is fine. That was a nice ride today. fun when your battery's low. I feel like this is just gonna kill my battery. Let's just get up this hill. All right, we did it. We made it. Back into eco. miles on the day it's not bad nowhere close to where the website says I should be getting but then again I still have a bar left
now that I'm not so uh, not so worried about battery life anymore, I know I can make it home from here. No, nope, we're gonna go right back around. Uh, I guess I'll just make food at home. I'm too indecisive. I can't make up my mind. Anyway, man, that was a really fun ride today. That was a really good ride. Talked to some cool people. Saw some cool stuff. Got a good range test in. That was a good ride. I just wish I had more range on this thing. If I could at least like buy a second battery and carry it with me. But even then, like, I don't know how I would carry it. I thought about getting, like, one of those, uh, like, Pelican cases or an Ilar case to put on the back. But I've been holding off on that, too, because I don't know how much space I'll have back there once I get the new seat. <sighs> I don't know what to do. I need to learn to be content. This thing is really freaking rad. That was a fun ride today, so... I need to not complain. I'm glad I got to get that ride in today before uh, the craziness of the next week. So I hope you guys enjoyed that ride. That was a long one. I don't know how I'm gonna cut that down into a 20 minute video. That was a couple hours. That was a really fun ride. Really beautiful. So I hope you guys like it. I really appreciate you guys watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Do you like more of the just uh, kind of ride along videos or do you? I know I talked a lot in that last one. Let me know in the comments what you want to see. You can head over and uh, follow me on Instagram, Jado Rides, if you're not already doing that. Anyway, that's going to be the video. Thanks again for watching. I appreciate you guys. You're awesome. We will see you on the next one. Hey. Are you so lonely today? You're a good boy. I love you.